Hello again people. Right, if you're new to this stuff, do not be afraid. What you need to do is go to my um, set of back to basics videos, which will show you a relatively clean chart with just a few indicators on there and one EMA. And um, basically, these lines are the result of um, probably about 10 15 minutes work first thing in the morning. And uh, what I do is draw levels on the candles, the highs and lows of candles that are likely to affect the price um, as it moves during the day or in particular when I like to trade during the uh, Frankfurt, pre-Frankfurt, Frank Frankfurt should I say, pre-Frankfurt, Frankfurt and London open. So that's the time between 6 to 7 pre-Frankfurt, 7 to 8 UK time that is, Frankfurt open and 8 o'clock the London open. <coughs> And I drew draw a set of lines. I've shown how I did it this morning. So if you watch uh, the video uh, one or two before this one, you will see exactly what I did. And then uh, I took my trades and created a video with those uh, trades there. I do not call trades, so never ever, disclaimer, do not trade my, uh, my analysis. Learn. I'm here to teach you how I do it. So, um, I would be really, I love teaching and I love trading. I love trading better because that makes me money. And then I love showing people how I do it almost as much. And the reason I create these videos is because it improves my trading massively. I started this YouTube cha channel years ago. I can't remember how many exactly. Three or four, maybe, maybe more. Time flies didn't get much take up so I gave up and I just uh, set, settled down to a routine of uh, one or two trades in the morning and then maybe one in the evening and spent the rest of the time dossing about basically but because I started this channel up again I thought I'll give it another go my trading has gone into the stratosphere and I really really would like to spend some of the time between trades making videos and helping others and that's it. No ulterior motive. I'm not looking to sign thousands of people up to newsletters. I can't believe how YouTube has changed since I was last here and uh, the likes of Twitter and stuff like that with people getting great big gangs of people to follow them uh, and pay them money, sending out newsletters and God knows what else. When they sh If they're making serious bucks at this, I think they should be doing it for free personally so if you like the sound of this just subscribe have a look at a load of the videos and you know don't be scared of all these lines because they really are straightforward if you look at my back to basics uh, uh, set shortly before this one you will be able to see uh, how I arrived at this uh, method it's devised by me inspired by someone I uh, paid for, paid a lot of money for, to be mentored with, with a group of people. And that was over 15 years ago. And uh, the trend analysis uh, was inspired by someone else before he took it on. I mean, you know, there's nothing new in trading, guys. And in fact, it's got better and a lot easier now than it was way back then because you've got better indicators like this one here it's solid gold this one this was my one i've had on my charts 15 years i can't share it as proprietary and i signed a non-disclosure for it but how i work how i choose my indicators test them if you like is that i've got a knowledge of candlesticks which means i could trade with nothing else on this chart but then I added the indicators to help uh, people I was trying to help to simplify things and you can test the indicators about with your own knowledge and other traders that can do this stuff will, will understand what I'm saying so that one 
abs uh, actually um, helps the other. I can't think of the proper word. Symbiotic, something like that. So, and then just really basic, um, old-fashioned uh, ascending and descending trend lines, wedges, things like that. And I've even got a unique way of uh, drawing my, um, what I consider unique, I've never come across it, of drawing my ascending and descending trend lines and uh, then tightening them up as the price starts to change its direction. As you can see, this has absolutely dropped off now. Uh, GJ has a habit of doing that. It is a beast. So anyway, we'll just quickly talk about um, the trade I took in, in a moment. But this indicator, if you take nothing else away from this, this is free. It's called RSI Histo Alert. Put it on your charts. It will look different than it does on here because I've changed the colours and dumped a few squiggly lines and things. But uh, you can play with it until you arrive at this uh, sort of configuration. Don't have to have the colours, but you just don't need the squiggly lines. And then basically, the power of this indicator comes into play when um, it it configures in a certain way. Whoever invented it did a damn fine job, in my opinion. I know you'll think indicators lag, but that's a an old wives' tale. They do lag when the market is volatile, but what you can do then is just take your lead from the higher time frame say for instance I told you that you need to do your homework on it but I t you know I know for a fact when that indicator busts through that 20 level you're going to get some volatility and I know the chart is messy I apologize for that but it's busted through there that's the candle it closed on then it moved um, somewhere in the region of 40 or so pips. Done the same here, whether it's just broken the level or not, you can check just by putting your, your uh, what's it on there. It doesn't look like it's quite made it on that one there. Yeah, 1888. So the following one is the, the sort of uh, trigger candle, if you like. That's the one before the dotted brown line there. And it's still moved up, shot up, 36 or 38 pips my eyes deceiving me and you'll see this a lot now once you've seen that once you see that on the higher time frame then the way I trade this uh, thing is drop to the lower time frame use all my uh, magic hokey pokey stuff that I'll, I've explained there's no secrets in what I do and it's all free uh, I've explained it in the previous videos you can you basically you can enter a, a signal given to you by the hourly time frame for example or this M30 time frame and you can enter it with the precision of the one minute time frame using exactly the same process and uh, that way you get very little drawdown and you get uh, pretty much instant results because you're uh, using the one minute time frame and you know who can all this about risk reward one to one and one four to one and all that malarkey and people trading a pound a pip and waiting 10 hours for a hundred pips a hundred pounds you could put I don't know 50 lots on at, at uh, a, a pip make five pips in two or three minutes or less than a minute sometimes or 15 pips in less than a minute because of the pr precise nature of this entry and instead of making a hundred dollars you've made a thousand dollars or fifty thousand dollars or whatever <clears throat> I know it sounds like magic but it isn't just think outside the box which is what I've done in the past ever since I saw that thing 15 years ago and then I went back over years and years of charts and I could see it worked I needed something that had longevity and price action has longevity price patterns this has not changed the way it works in years and years and years so I've attached that to that to that to that and it's broken out that was probably written in Steve Nyson's book of tricks well I know I sat in the garden 15 16 years ago and read that book and thought this looks good 
Steve Nyson's candlestick analysis and I've never looked back since. It's been tough but I'm here to help you if you want me to. You can. I don't want to get a massive group of people but if you understand the importance of what I'm trying to show you here then I will answer videos or answer by video, bespoke videos, questions you may have about my trading method. Not stupid ones. You have to read or, or watch all the videos or watch a majority of them. When you see this on your charts, this is my latest stuff. Anything prior to the RSI histogram, discard really, because this thing is magic. It's, it's, you know, it's put my trading into overdrive. So, um, and it isn't magic, it's damn hard price action, trend analysis, technical analysis, and uh, su support and resistance analysis. That's it, there's nothing else on this method of mine that uh, would um, confuse you. So guys, thanks for watching. I will just quickly show you the trade for those up to years, which I'm very, very grateful. Um, the level that I put, all these levels were put on my charts in about 15 minutes flat first thing this morning, and then I trade the levels. I traded the break of that one using the indicators and my chart analysis, the candlestick trends that I talk about to that level there. And then because of the time of day, I know we're going to get volatility. I want to be trading this, I said in the previous video, when the price will move in minutes so I don't have to sit in the charts, sit in front of the charts all day long. Excuse me for that. Someone's text me. Um, so I've got a second trade on that within minutes. In fact, I took it mo the same minute that previous trade closed. And then uh, this trade, I've been watching it all morning, making videos. You can clearly see what happened here. We'd broken out and closed through a level there. In fact, I'll draw that level on. There. Both that candle and that candle, excuse me, were closed through. It was an H, uh, let's have a look. Oh, well, it'll just show an N5 high on here, but it's probably an H1 high. I'm going to take it off my chart because I don't want it messing it up, <laughs> he says as if it's not looking messed it up but this is all done mechanically this is as mechanical as you can possibly get in a method that I'm aware of so then once this showed me we should be taking this long broke through the 20 there as you can see with uh, vigor there whoops I keep forgetting it does that Close through the 20 there, it doesn't repaint, remember. Once it had broken through that 20 there, I was all over this, didn't want to miss this at all. That's over 15 pips, pips net, net of spread. And um, notice also that when you look at the higher time frames, I'm not worried about this. Uh, this is broken out. I'm not worried about this returning on me, even with the beast because the higher time frames are showing me the way. 15 minutes just broken out two highs here. That means massive momentum. You know, I love this traffic light system. I hate the squiggly lines on the RSI and the stochastics. Give me this all day long. And uh, it was backed up by my braces, belt and braces, and uh, all over this like a rash. So probably if I hadn't been making videos here, I would have been walking the dog and missed this trade. So that's why I make the videos. That's why I'm happy to do them. Enjoy it while I've got nothing else to distract me. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Don't forget to subscribe and like and um, comment. Ask me questions. If I can help you, I will. Oh, thank you for watching. And just in case I didn't do the disclaimer earlier, um, do not trade any of my recommendations. I'm just training 
teaching, whatever this. Learn, I'm teaching you to learn how to trade like this yourselves. Green pips.